Well, hi kids, it's really great to be back with you again. And last week I had to deal with some pretty windy weather, didn't I? I mean, it was so windy, it even knocked the camera over at the end of my talk. So I thought today I might do a kids talk about wind because I had to deal with so much last week. Now I'm standing next to the trampoline, our family trampoline, and if you have been to Lincoln Baptist over the last couple of years, you'll have heard a lot of stories about this trampoline. You'll have heard stories about the wind knocking it over, you'll have heard stories about it rolling across the garden, you'll either even have heard a story about it getting blown over and getting caught in this tree that's above me right now. And so I thought with all the wind last week, it's actually an important thing to learn how to get this trampoline to stay in one place. So what we've done is we've put it in the corner of our garden, and I don't know if you'll be able to see this, maybe a picture will come up. We've managed to buy some straps, and these straps take the trampoline and pin it to the ground, they anchor it to the ground. And it's just a strap that goes around the base of the trampoline, and it goes all the way down to like a corkscrew that we twist into the ground, almost like a big massive screw that we drill right into the ground. And there's four of them all the way around the trampoline, and it keeps the trampoline stuck to the ground. It's what we call an anchor to the ground, it keeps it stuck and the wind will not blow it over. And it's a really good thing we've managed to do this because hopefully I don't have to chase it around the garden all the time. But it reminds me of a verse, and here's the verse. It's Hebrews chapter 6 and from verse 19 it says, We have this as a sure and steadfast anchor of the soul. This is a verse that talks about the promises of God and when it gets windy and difficult in life and when there's lots of things we find really hard, this verse reminds us that the promise of God is that he will look after us and he'll keep us safe. Just like these anchors that I put on this trampoline to keep it safe, the promises of God keep us safe just like an anchor. And the best anchor of all is Jesus and his love for us. Jesus is our anchor, our hope. When we get into really difficult times, when we have to try new things, when we find things really hard, we can be assured, we can feel safe because we have the anchor of God's promises. So next time when you think of an anchor on a boat or if you think of a, these anchor straps around my trampoline, think about that God will make sure you are safe even when things get really tough. Well, I should probably stop talking to you now and let one of the kids on to jump around. So we'll see you next week.